Okay. Back again. So, our first move is probably going to be to take out Alexandria, if we can. Do we have a truce with the guy who is technically... I don't think so. Yes, we do. Okay, yes, we do. We have a truce Sultan Latif. Well, could we kill him? Maybe. That assassination. 25% chance of success, 44% chance of being discovered. He is living where? He's tutored by Emir, that guy of Tripoli. Okay, where are you? You're at court in Cairo. Okay, so he's in Cairo right now. Spy master, I have a job for you. Gerard of Asheridge, you have been serving me faithfully for a great many years. Go forth. It's bread murder upon Sultan Latif. Okay, that's much better. We have a 37% chance of success, 19% chance of being discovered. Make it so. Okay, use the thugs. Please make it so. There we go, joyous news. Sultan Latif died not knowing the name of his killer. Make sure the assassins stay silent. We could fight for Alexandria now. Where are our ships? Is my question. Okay, they're not too close, so we will wait. My liege, may you live in harmony and contentment? Oh, good. Good job, Nikitas. Uh, as a reward. I'm going to see if I can marry you off. Do I have... Somebody I can marry him to, though. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. Let's go to her diplomacy. She has strong inheritable claims on all of my stuff. Well, most of it. Hmm. Would he take matrilineal marriage? No. Lorenzo, my kinsman, would though. Hmm. I'm going to marry her to Lorenzo instead. Um. And yeah, go, go to the Oubliette. I don't care. Die. Really? You have excommunicated Duke Apollonius. Well, he likes me anyway. Um, I'm going to ask you to convert. No, because you are a ruler. Here, have some money. Now you'll convert. Hell yeah. He's excommunicated anyway. So it's not like he really had all that much choice in the matter. I mean, what was he going to do? Go, no, I'm sorry. I'm too busy being excommunicated at the minute. And I believe now I can recommunicate him. Lift it. Yes. And then he'll be happy with me, I think. Yeah. I think there's a sort of like an intervene for me. Yeah, lifted in excommunication. Sweet. But he's not he's not Norman, he's still Greek. But that's alright. Uh, when he has a kid. Or is his kid already being educated? No. We must fix this. I think I was educating him myself like I was actually educating him um, I will give you to Serlo Serlo is actually quite good at this whole conversion thing he's content though Habil Muamarad Muamarid died a natural death congratulations that's that's a very very rare thing in our realm the lords of Armenia have approved the institution of normal feudal laws well I don't care not my problem Alright. I might give out a few more kingdom titles, maybe, just to make things easier. But, I don't know yet. Maybe. I would like to uh, unite all of this, though. So maybe we could uh, take Alexandria, kill the, <laughs> kill the new sultan, take all these places, kill the next new sultan, maybe capture this area. We'll see. We'll see. Who is he currently fighting, actually? He's currently fighting someone's host claim on Egypt, and another host claim. So he's fighting two hosts at the moment. Nazi died in the dungeons of my of my imperial dungeoniness. Good. 
Okay. Where's Sultan? Oh! Other Sultan got uh, booted out. Well, that is a damn shame. Um, I want Alexandria. Oh, yeah, I need to get Ascalon too, don't I? Alright, well, I want Alexandria first, seeing as it's uh, sort of um, important to reforming the Roman Empire. So, land in Alexandria, please. Consumption is broken out in Ghent. That is a damn shame. It is also not my problem. That is an army of you lot, so I may... Yeah, I'll chase them. Hello. The population of Beirut has converted to the Catholic faith. Well done. Success. Okay, so I was fighting those guys for absolutely no reason. They're not actually my enemy. Back to Alexandria. Hello. You were my enemy though, weren't you? I think. I don't know. All I know is we can take this place. Murder! And... Again. So are they actually forming an army to face me? Not really. They can't really do all that much, but if they decide to come and attack me, I can face them in the field and whack them. We lost trade post. Big deal. Doesn't count. Count Lancelin can go fuck himself. Alright. Assault! Salt it with salt. Um, you have got really, really small armies, and it's not going to really help you. Sorry. Raiders under Chief Husson, or Husson, of Atalia have arrived to loot and pillage in Seleucia. I can't do anything about it. You can if you want to, Armenian King, but I can't do Jack Diddley Poop, because I'm not declaring war on the Golden Horde for you. Sorry. 33 days. Would you surrender now, though? Nope, the war is apparently indecisive. I must have missed the memo. You are arriving on the 25th of June. If I march now, when would I arrive? On the 5th of July. Okay. Where are you guys actually going? Okay, you're going... The... Wait, where are you going? No, you're going south-south. Okay. Forget it. I'm not interested. Presumably they're going to uh, go attack whoever it is that's attacking them. Excuse me a second. Oh, sneezles. Alright, so. Attack. Alright, 65%. He's still not really convinced that uh, we're going to win. 71%. Are you convinced now? No, come on you pansy. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I can't hear you over the sound of the ass kicking I'm giving you. Alright, what about Al Alamein? Mm, no, that's a lot of men. That's a lot of men. That's a lot of men. This is probably our best bet, and we can go back to Alexandria if we have to. So, the trade post of Katan Katanzaro. Oh, that's where he went. Oh, well, whoop de bloody do. You have fun over there. I'm going to have fun over here actually accruing war score. I hope you have a nice time over there. Bryce asks, where do heathens come from? They are people just like us, they are demons from hell, or they are men like us, but unbeliever enemies. That one's actually probably the best one, so I'm going to go for that. He's just. Cool. Uh, you cannot besiege that, you don't have enough men. Good. And assault. Assault it with salt. We have... Dragged Walid Fatimid out of his hiding hole. Good. You are now at 82% war score. Why will you not surrender, you fool? Okay. I'm going to kill more of you guys. I hope you're happy. 98%. Right. Let us go and kill these fools. Because I think we can. Attack! Murder! Murder! Yeah, there they go. Uh, Salukia. I don't care. There we go. 100%. How do you feel now that I've kicked your ass all the way up and down the square? Alright, time to get rid of these holdings. I also discovered that, you know, no hassles vassals. It's cool, but it's kind of irrelevant at this point because I can just do this, like so, and then just hand out the holdings to one of my generated barons. And I can, you know, check to see if any of them are actually kind of good first. 
So no hassles vassals is good, but I think it's probably more useful for when you actually give a good goddamn about who holds land. Like this guy. He's gonna still get Gazir. He's still gonna get it. Because I can just put him under somebody who's content. Hopefully. Let's see. Who are you? No, you're ambitious as well. That's alright. Because I don't care. I hold so much land that nobody is actually going to rebel against me. Uh, what about you? Anyone good? See, this guy, he's good. He's good, and he's going to get Alexandria and the duchy of it. And I'll give him Al Alamein as well. Actually, I'll give him Katara. And somebody else, Al Alamein. Yeah, you're good too. Here you go, you get Al Alamein. And you get Katara. There we go. I could have kept one of those for myself, but I don't want to. And we can usurp the Emirate of Alexandria. Make you the Duke. Congratulations on your promotion. Apparently, we can usurp the petty kingdom of... Oh, this, this guy. Uh, apparently we can't, but he's being attacked by... The... Duchess of Moray, as well as Duke Geoffrey of Gwynedd. I don't care. Oh, that's excommunication war, so it won't even make a difference. Not really. Um, Cordoba? No. Triple Atania? I guess I could create it, but I don't want to. Because then somebody will be like, oh, you've got the Kingdom of Africa. I'd like that, thanks. And I'd have to go, you knew, not getting it. Okay. How many ships can you raise? I guess I don't know yet. Oh, right, none. Because recently conquered in your administration. I forgetted. Is there anywhere else around here that we could take now with our troops? You know, I sort of want Asuf. I sort of want it. What are my chances of killing this son of a bitch? About the same as when I tried to kill the kid earlier. Let's do it. Nice. Nice. You see ya. You dead, son. Um. Yeah, get rid of those. Basically, all of these are useless. At, um. The thing that's really nice is that because we've asked a couple of guys up here to convert to Catholicism, and then I made one of the guys who did convert a king, he's gonna ask everybody else over here to convert. So let's have a look at the religious breakdown. No one's actually converted yet. But, all those lines mean that someone, yeah, okay, so their religion does not match the guy in charge. He's basically got everyone to convert, except for Duchess Valeria, I think. Have you converted? No. How about you? No. Are you being educated? Oh, you're being educated by a, a Greek. Well, that's okay. Yeah, I'm pretty much just going to leave people to do what they want to do. Because it's really not all that important when it comes down to it. Oh yeah, we should get a message in a second about uh, reconquering Alexandria. Yeah, there we go. With the city back under East Roman control, the Patriarchate of Alexandria has been properly restored as one of the epi God damn it. <laughs> episcopal sees of the Pentarchy in the Eastern Orthodox Church. It was originally founded by St. Mark the Evangelist, who became Alexandria's first patriarch. God be praised! Go us. Oubliette. And uh, now, can I declare war on you for this whole area? Or do I have to declare war on you for Tripoli? Wait, am I thinking of the wrong spot? Maybe. Yes, yes I am. No, I want... No, I don't want that. Triple Atania, that's what I'm thinking of, and to I guess I could, but hmm. I sort of want Asuf first, because that's not really a big deal. 
So let's go for Ascalon instead. Yes. War. Good golf, y'all. Attack. We will slaughter this son of a bitch. We will slaughter him with our slaughtering things. Actually, we might just hang out here. Slowly besiege things down. Oh, hang on, no, we'd have to face off against that. Actually, we sort of have to anyway, so continue marching. Okay, we didn't catch him. Uh, Duchess Emma of Provence seeks to fabricate a claim on the King of Burgundy. Get fucked. Um, 16,000 against what's he got over here. Let's just follow. My Emperor, I am pleased to report that the majority of people in Accra have converted to the Catholic faith. Sweet. And yes, I will forgive you this once. Murder! Now, let us march like so. See if we can't uh, scoop up some of these people. Oh, hello. You are not coming to us. You're going to get there on the 15th. We're going to get to you on the 12th. Are we going to be attacking? We're going to be attacking over a river. So, no thanks. I'm going to change where I'm going. All right. I could not help but overhear the stable master and courtier's animated discussion. Something about a horse and payment due today, but the courtier insisted to pay the stable master later that week. Pope Mark. Oh dear. I settled the matter between Pope Mark and my stable master. I tried to be as just as I could. They still will not speak with each other. You know, I think I'm going to have to attack. Yeah. 24th. We're going to get there on the 27th. Okay, just change destination again. Actually, let's attack from here. Duchess Beatrice of Champagne has usurped the title from Countess Adelaide of Rems. Okay. To the wretched Emperor Simon I, your low character is the subject of Greek plays. This is a formal declaration of war. Our armies shall meet on the field of battle. Who are you? Oh, Kagan of the Ilkhanate. Really? Yeah, I'm going to attack you here now. Sucker. Um, okay, well, now I'm defending against infidels again, so you're going to really love me, aren't you? Uh, my king. You are, aren't you? Yeah, you, you love me. Defending my titles. Oh, what's he fighting for? Armenia. Sounds good to me. Dude, I need your men. How many can you give me? 23,000? Fuck yeah. Dude. Sweet. <laughs> Alright, now we need to just get up in this area and smack them about a bit. I probably actually don't need to raise any more vassal levies. He'll do just fine. Oi. Come here. Oi. Come back. God damn it. Come here. You son of a bitch. Alright, now I've got you. There we go. Uh, who is it? My daughter. No. No, 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 no. I am looking after her myself. Thank you kindly, I can find somebody better. Ingrid is pregnant again. And a Waldenesian uprising has been... Seriously? Waldenesians. Why? Alright, come on. Kill, kill, kill. Done. Alright, march over. Ooh, hang on. Wait. Am I still at war with the same person? Yes. Okay, are you going to surrender to me at any point? The war is indecisive. Yes, sort of. I'll just have to kill you. Then it won't be quite so indecisive. The defenders of Narbonne sallied forth. You know what? I actually don't have to worry about it, because I can deal with this by raising your troops, can't I? Because I'm still defending against infidels. So you guys love me. Perfect. Everybody marched loose. You want to... Oh, right. Betrothed can marry. I want to make sure that it's matrilineal. So, no. I know. It doesn't really make all that much of a difference. We are both the same 
uh, dynasty, but I do sort of want to make sure that it's you know, a marriage on my terms. What the hell are you doing here? What are you doing there? Golden Horde? What are you doing? You're fighting... Mesopotamia... Oh, what? That's confusing. Oh, hello. Where did you get all those men? I might need to raise some more. 2,000 troops. Huh? And you are in servitude to this fellow. Yeah. Alright, everybody march for, um... For here, yes. To the Magnificent Empress Simon, I have decided to accept your suggestion that Princess Yvonne and King Lorenzo get married. Good. Defeated a trade post. 15th of September. Will we get there first? Ye yes. At least you will. You will not. But yes, we'll get there first. Okay, that could be fantastic because there is a river between here and here. And I believe that this is mountainous terrain. Let's have a look. Yeah. Yeah, he should be in for a bit of a ruffle stomping. If I'm reading that right, and it's entirely possible that I may not be. But I think I am. Alright, I'm going to stomp you so hard. My ward Bryce has a tender and loving soul, trusting everyone in the castle. Be kind. Yeah, 26%. We really need to capture the land that we're actually fighting for, but for now... I'm okay with attacking this. We might get it still. Oh, yeah. You destroyed a trade post. Good fucking job. You should be really proud. Really? Dwin. Oh, okay. No, we weren't going to get there first. Dwin. Really? 7th of October, 19th. Hmm. Huh. Okay. March there. We might make it. 19th of October. You're going to get... Oh, no. No, we wouldn't. We might make it here. Yeah. Well, they're not my levies. <laughs> that's that's pretty much all I'm thinking of here. They're not my levies, so fuck it. Let's attack. Uh, can we actually do that? Oh, we can do that. Yes, done. And I'm going to give it to... No, you're a Scotsman. I'm going to give it to... Solo of Gwent. I'm a nice guy. Hey, Solo. Dude. That is technically part of your land, right? I think so. Whatever. Congratulations, you are now the Duke of that place. Okay, so there's 14,000 Ilkhanate guys there. Doesn't look like they're reinforcing. Oubliette. What just happened? Oh, right. The, uh, the, the Holy Bull... Invasion of Mesopotamia thing. Ah, oh, forget it. Intrigue advances siege in Narbonne. Good thing you reminded me, game, otherwise I might have forget it. Killed them. What was that? Siege of Lori. Oh, okay. Right. That's okay. We should still win. He's just bleeding away troops right now. It's not going to help him. Boo. 12th of January, 14th of January. Really? Well, that's okay. 24th of January. If they want to run away, that's that's fine with me. Because now I'm going to trap them outside of the land. A son was born in the purple to Empress Simon the Apostle and Empress Ingrid named Odric. No. I prefer the name... Hmm, what's a good, what's a good name? Actually, let's have another look. In the old dynasty tree. Who haven't we had a name used for a little while? Nigel? No, we've had a couple of Nigels. We haven't had a Brian in a while. We've only had one William. Will ooh, no. William. Nice. Actually, let's have a look at our son's stats. See if he's any good. 
Not really. He's just born in the purple. But then again, he's like a zero-year-old child, so fair enough that he hasn't really got anything special about him just yet. Kind of makes sense. Kill them. And kill them. Yeah, so much for those gains you made. Now let's see if we can't force them... Where the heretic? Really? Really? Like what? Seriously? There's another... God. Really? Whatever. At least we're wiping them out. Ferrand was captured. Good. Now let's see if we can't kill... Actually. Where are they all going? They're all going to Carcassonne. Let us follow. Uh, I still don't care. Just FYI. Really? You're the heir to the... Yeah. I need to educate you with somebody. Somebody Norman. Uh, Humbert. He seems like a good guardian. Um. I thought you guys weren't going to get pissed about that. Maybe you still get pissed about it. But I'm defending against infidels. Infidels! Alright, 63%. We're gonna have to go kill this guy. It seems my dalliance with... I didn't, even, I didn't even know I did that! But okay. It seems my dalliance with Baroness Hermesent has resulted in a child. For, fortunately, the father thinks that the little child is his. How long, I wonder, does it take... Uh, yes, yes, temperance is good. I wonder how long it takes before he finally cottons on to the fact that, you know, there's something odd. Every time the Emperor comes to visit, my wife gets pregnant. I wonder why. Oh, God. Now, right, where are you going? You're going to Karen. Good. I will wait there for you. Or, I will attack you here. 13th of May. Yes, I should get there first. Ha ha! Beware! We are kicking... Okay, we're getting our asses kicked. But it should turn in a second. Uh, failed Sally, the Duke, the Defenders of Orange. What? Oh, okay. Yes, let us go kill them. Now, how goes the battle? About as well as could be expected. Okay, now we're getting him. Are you kidding me? There's bloody rebellions everywhere. That's the other thing I don't like about uh, having big empires. Everyone suddenly decides, you know what? We want our freedom. We want our freedom too. You guys can get fucked. The army of Helios. And all this time, we haven't even been doing anything about this guy, have we? Kill. And 19 days, okay. I've got time to deal with this. Who killed them? Alright, they're not getting away this time. Those troublesome peasants, are you kidding me? I hate you all. Okay, you will now surrender. Good. We won. You lose. Okay, they're actually fighting in Northampton. Northampton's one of mine. I'm gonna have to lead troops, personally. Give me all of your men. All of them. How many is that? 12,000. Okay, let's march there. Let's march, yeah, let's march to London. You will give me some men too. There's London, right? Yeah. Well, it's where London is. Uh, I don't need your troops anymore. You can go away. You're still getting cranky about the whole raised levies thing. I'm doing this to defend your title, you son of a bitch. It's not for my own entertainment. Fancy that. Really? You know, that's funny, because <laughs> you know where my army is. One that's kicking the crap out of everybody else. You know, that one. It's right fucking next door. Okay, 
We won the Mongol invasion. That is a plus. Now go away. I don't need you anymore. I will deal with you later. 